Hi guys, if you're anything like me, you're well aware that The Last of the Mohicans is one of the most exceptional, epic, historical drama movies of all time. So sit back, relax, and let's dive into the world of The Last Mohicans like never before. We'll have the entire cast of Then and Now, and I will be revealing all of the juicy details about the original names of the characters and how the actors have changed since then. Okay. Let's check it out together. Daniel Day-Lewis was born on April 29, 1957 in London, England. He played the character Nathaniel Hawkeye Bumpo in the movie when he was 35 years old in 1992. Currently, he's living happily at the age of 66. Steal his lands to sell them for gold to the white man. Would Huron have greed for more land than a man can use? Was your on full steady and also the craziness because we would like to agree with the music Paul Thomas Anderson, of course, and then the gentleman sitting next to you he <laughs> is the actual best actor in Madeline Stowe was born on August 18th, 1958, in Los Angeles, California. She played the character Cora Monroe in the movie when she was 34 years old in 1992. Currently, she's living happily at the age of 64. Yeah, watch yeah. this look. Oh, she's full bitch here, right? <laughs> <laughs> That's okay. okay. He's not the guy for you. Okay. And what? Russell Means was born on November 10th, 1939, in Porcupine Pine Ridge Indian Reservation. He played the character Chingachgook in the movie when he was 53 years old in 1992. Unfortunately, Means died after suffering from throat cancer on October 22nd, 2012 in Rapid City, South Dakota at the age of 72. This place at the council fire, my people. Yezunkas. The uh, military, the U.S. military occupies is called a reservation. That's why... Eric Schweig was born on June 19, 1967, in Inuvik, Northwest Territories, Canada. He played the character Uncas in the movie when he was 25 years old in 1992. Currently, he's living happily at the age of 55. Michael Mann is notorious for doing take after take after take, so I probably ran up, up and down that hill, the usual, like on average about 15 or 20. Jody May was born on May 8, 1975 in Camden Town, London, England. She played the character Alice Munro in the movie when she was 17 years old in 1992. Currently, she's living happily at the age of 48. What if the sword of Islam aren't after money? Over the past two years, all hostage scenarios in Iraq, Afghanistan and Pakistan that have been resolved, have been resolved. Stephen Waddington was born on November 28, 1968 in Leeds, UK. He played the character Major Duncan Hayward in the movie when he was 24 years old in 1992. Currently, he's living happily at the age of 54. Major! Long calm is a soldier and a It's um, MI5 losers, effectively. So it's um, the best um, people in MI5 go to a certain place, and the losers... Wes Study was born on December 17, 1947, in No Fire Hollow, Oklahoma. He played the character Magua in the movie when he was 45 years old in 1992. Currently, he's living happily at the age of 75.
Maurice Roavez was born on March 19, 1937 in Sunderland County, Durham, England. He played the character Colonel Edmund Monroe in the movie when he was 55 years old in 1992. Unfortunately, Roavez died after a period of ill health on July 14, 2020 at the age of 83. Everything that's happened, he knows all about the Welsh legend. He, he knows that it's happened before, uh, uh, many years ago. And uh, how he knows, I wouldn't tell you. Patrice Chareo was born on November 2nd, 1944, in Lazinga, Maine et Laurie, France. He played the character General Louis Joseph de Montclaim in the movie when he was 48 years old in 1992. Unfortunately, Chareo died from lung cancer on October 7th, 2013 in Paris, France at the age of 68. Which is necessary for the honor of your prince. But now I beg you to listen to the admonitions of humanity. I beg you to consider my terms for your surrender. I'm the king of montage. But because I'm a very good monteur. Ah, oui, c'est vrai. François Gédigé, il s'appelle. Ah, oui, c'est génial. Et vous dites, euh, en fait, le montage, c'est l'essentiel de. Edward Blatchford was born on September 1st, 1955, in Michigan. He played the character Jack Winthrop in the movie when he was 37 years old in 1992. Currently, he's living happily at the age of 67. Terry Kinney was born on January 29, 1954, in Lincoln, Illinois. He played the character John Cameron in the movie when he was 38 years old in 1992. Currently, he's living happily at the age of 69. Dennis Banks was born on April 12, 1937, in Leech Lake Indian Reservation, Minnesota. He played the character Anga Was Gone in the movie when he was 55 years old in 1992. Unfortunately, Banks died of complications from pneumonia following heart surgery on October 29, 2017 in Rochester, Minnesota at the age of 80. We kept the, the activity with the lawsuits alive, and two years later, uh, five of the ten guilty, found guilty of police brutality, and they were, they were let go. And as a matter of fact, the other five were let go as well. And, uh, but they, 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 they... Pete Postlet Waite was born on February 7, 1946, in Warrington, England. He played the character Captain Beams in the movie when he was 46 years old in 1992. Unfortunately, Postlet Waite died on January 2nd, 2011 in Shrewsbury, England at the age of 64. I think in yeah. Leicester Square where there's this big tent which is um, uh, heated by newspapers that are thrown away on the subway, you know, London. <laughs> Sorry. Um, we're turning up on bikes, I think, yeah. or, you know, so they're down a green carpet, not a red carpet. Ah. Calm Meany was born on May 30th, 1953, in Dublin, Ireland. He played the character Major Ambrose in the movie when he was 39 years old in 1992. Currently, he's living happily at the age of 69. At, at, at great actors, right? And you are a great actor, and I, and I see Sometimes Star Trek, like you had the pants on and the. What? Like, no. Uh, well, that's what did you? you I would do. I always remember. Good, no, and they were difficult to learn, you know. So, yeah. so you'd be doing your, your blah, 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 and the, you know, or moving into. Before we wrap up this journey through the world of the movie The Last Mohicans, I want to hear from you. Who is your favorite character from the movie? 
What's this thing that they have that is so appealing to you? Share your thoughts and feelings in the comment section below and don't forget to turn on the bell notification so you're always the first to know when new content is released. Your support and engagement mean the world to me. Thank you for joining me on this journey down memory lane.